good day my friends we're gonna see how well this phone holder holds on to the phone it looks like it jiggles a lot so the videos are probably gonna look like shit I'm not entirely certain just how uh, <clears throat> how good it's gonna sound I got my hands free and the phone's right in front of the steering wheel so that I don't have to take my hand off the wheel in order to fuck with the phone because that's about the safest thing you can do and uh oh shit if i wouldn't wash my glasses i could go well yeah here we are driving first fucking time in nine years i've already put on about 60 miles i had to run the dog to the vet and do a bunch of other stuff got a propane tank in the back gotta get that gotta go to other places get some other supplies do some other stuff and that Yep, driving. It's a fascinating thing. After so many years without the capability, it's uh, strange. You know, it's this really odd feeling of freedom that I haven't felt in a very long time. <clears throat> you know, you watch all your friends drive all the time. You watch other people drink and drive all the time. You just... Just kind of sucks day after day after day you gotta go get supplies you want to work on a project you don't have all the shit you need you can't get a ride there's just absolutely no reason to ever fuck up and lose your license because not only do they make it a real bastard and a real expensive bastard at that to get your license back it isn't fun <laughs> it isn't fun at all this time, this half of my life here, I'm going to try real hard not to, whoa, guy doing a U-turn in the middle of the highway, holy balls, that's again the law, well I guess it ain't, there ain't no signs, but, should pull off on another road, turn around there, and then fuck come back instead of pulling off in front of people and shit, tell you what man, one thing I've noticed in nine years of being an observer and a co-pilot, most of the people on the road can't drive for shit. And a lot less of them are even paying any fucking attention while they're going. They're texting, driving, they're looking down, they ain't brain dead. A lot of fucking brain dead people. Half people in this country can't even read our road signs because they never bothered to learn how to speak our language. The other half just don't even give a shit. And then you got people that just would desperately love to be able to drive again. They can't. I said I served my time. I served almost double my sentence just because I didn't want to jump through all the hoops and I didn't have the money to jump through all the hoops because, you know, like $7,000 later and uh, Lord knows how many missed opportunities and how many other things as such. Lord knows how much money I've really lost not being able to drive for nine years. And uh, now it's just, I don't even know. You guys don't hardly ever see me smile, but uh, it's cool. It's cool. I try not to get too uppity about shit if I can help it, but it's really cool. Even driving a little grandma car. I'm not going to put the Trans Am on the road till the roads are clear and salt and snow is gone but uh <clears throat> yeah that's uh that's what we're doing so i'll probably put on a few more videos i got uh, some really bad news actually i'm gonna be driving down in south missouri tomorrow uh i'll tell you that story when i get on the road but for now my friends be careful be smart Drive safe. Good day.